Good afternoon. Uh, we have started our plant life cycle unit with my K1 class, and we are going to read How Do Plants Grow? And it is by Julie Lundgren. So we read this one today to fill out a plants can have and need chart, and the kids did wonderfully. So that way, now with this video, they will have this reference for how do plants grow. Almost all plants need sun to grow. Almost. Most plants also need water and good soil. Most. Not all, but most. Plants have many parts that help them get what they need to grow. And I, this part is what we see. The part that grows above the ground, but there's like a whole other world that goes on underground. Most plants have roots. Most. There's that word most again. Most plants have stems. That's the part that connects from the roots to the flower and connects the leaves in between. Roots and stems carry water from the soil to the plants. Carrots are roots. They are called a root vegetable. This is the part we eat. I love carrots. Most plants have leaves. All of these are the leaves. Leaves collect sunlight. Let's see what that your bad sunlight. Green plants change sunlight, air, and water into food. That process is called photosynthesis. Plants use the food they make to live and grow. Can you name all the parts of a plant? What do the parts do? How is the sun important to plants? And then we have our picture glossary here that leaves the plant part that is usually green and flat, leaves are attached to the stem. Roots, the plant part that gets water and nutrients from the soil for the whole plant to use. Soil, soil is the dirt in which a plant grows. Plants get water and nutrients from the soil. That's these, and it shows the picture of the leaves, roots, and soil, and here in the parentheses, we have the pronunciation guide to help us say the words. And on the other page, we have stems. Stems support the plant and carry water to the leaves from the roots. Sunlight. Plants use the sun's energy in the form of sunlight to make their own food. Water. Water is the colorless liquid that falls as rain. Plants cannot live without water. There are those pictures. There's the stem, beautiful sunlight, and some pretty blue water. And these words have the pronunciation guide too. Good 
very cool, very cute book, very informative, and I hope you enjoyed.